What's up, bro? It's my, it's my <laughs> hometown friend. Yeah. TV lovers, movie lovers. Wait, I mean, because if y'all really know, if y'all like rewind back to that drum line. <laughs> their drum line. <laughs> Smacking that ass. <laughs> Smacking that ass. <laughs> man, my man Omar Durst. If, if, it's been like all this talk about the year of the woman and the woman and black girl magic. Yeah. But one of the great things that we've seen about the show Queen Sugar is you and Kofi have like just lifted up in the in the eyes of these audiences. How does it feel to be a part of that movement, but to be able to shine as a man in that movement? It's amazing. We can't leave out uh, uh, Timothy Cal Durant. Can't leave out Dundre. Yeah. Uh, Whitfield. We can't leave out Nick Ash, man. Um, these just the writing on that show for men is, is tremendous. Even though it's a female, uh, you know, it's, it's, a, it's a female audience and the, the leads are females, but man, they write very strong, strong uh, male, you know, uh, uh, characters. Yeah. So I'm just, just very proud to be a part of that whole movement. I know y'all be shooting in hot New Orleans. I was yes. gonna say some vulgar stuff yeah. with that, yeah. but uh, but you just finished shooting the Halloween. I sure did, man. I just finished shooting Halloween. Uh, man, when I tell you, your thing gonna be a classic. And when you see Sheriff Barker, I play Sheriff Barker, man, chasing around Michael Myers. Uh, it's funny because, you know, it's written by uh, David Gordon Green and written by Danny McBride. Wow. So, you know, I work with them, of course, on Eastbound and Down. Yeah. Uh, man, it's, but it's, it's, it's just another part of, of that classic uh, film, man. Just got finished working with Jamie Lee Curtis on Saturday, actually. Wow. So, man, it's, 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 it's going to be something very, very, it's going to be something special. It comes out October 18th or 19th. I forgot which day, but just go see it because it's coming out during Halloween and everybody's going to love it. <laughs> Speaking of Halloween, a lot of people have been talking about people will be wearing Black Panther outfits this year. And I know that you got Queen Sugar and Halloween and probably a number of other projects that's right. coming behind that. Yeah. But what does Black Panther mean to you as an actor? You know what, man? I don't mean a name drop, but I, man, I remember like a few weeks ago when, it, when they had the premiere, I hit up Chad uh, Bozeman. I was like, Man, you buzzing right. I mean, you guys have been buzzing since Jackie Robinson. I was like, you are on the tip of everybody in the world's tongue right now. And I just told him how proud I was of him. Because, you know, we all, it's just a whole bunch of us where we all came up together, yeah. you know. And just to see where everybody is, man, it's just, you know, it's mind boggling sometimes. But I am, I'm ready. I got my tickets for 11 o'clock on Thursday night <laughs> next week and I'm about to be all up in there. I'm going to have my dashiki on and my gold teeth. It's going to be real black. <laughs> well, we can't wait for season three yeah. and Halloween and everything yes, else you got, bro. All right, bro. Good seeing you. Good seeing you. Decatur's always greater. You heard it. <laughs> y'all make sure y'all remember Decatur is where it's greater.